first thing always is what we'll get there. So, who's out of our your safety? Don't mean to sound cruel about it. That's just the way it is. Your safety. If you can't function, you can't help those people in there. We want you to go home at the end of it. So, protective equipment. Do a scene evaluation. Make sure you get all that there. Second thing, what we do when we get there, you can be talking, or arranging. If your guys are in the truck together, the different positions you're going to be doing, and then what do you do as an incident commander first thing when you get there? Do a look around because where can the victims be when we get to a bad wreck where this car is split like this? Anywhere, and anywhere. Not necessarily just there. He's identified. We do have victims. If it was out, you check the ditches, they could have walked off, stumbled off, we don't want to get through the scene, get back and they say, well, Johnny was with Jimmy, and where's Johnny at? So we, somebody's going to take responsibility for it, so we're going to do a scene size up. If Bill's come up with a plan of action, you're going to have to do extrication, and you're also going to have to do patient care. First thing you would do, make it scene safe, you got your gear on, do a quick patient check, correct? Right. We'll keep those things in mind as we go. The rest of us, let's stay back out of the way, give them room. If they should need an extra hand, I don't have any problem with that.